Okay, so now that we know about the direct selection tool, and we know about that pen tool and how it can add points or take points away, now we can get in and start using the pen tool for what it's really for, which is drawing vector shapes. This is kind of the premier tool here, and, uh, and you're going to have to play around with it a little bit to get used to it, but it's also a lot of fun. The most important thing is remembering that you can come back and edit the, with the direct selection tool, so you don't have to get everything perfect the first time. So let's do this. I'm going to go grab my pen tool. I'm going to make sure I have a line on. Uh, and the pen tool can be used in two ways. First, you can just click, 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 clicking around and they draw points without vector handles, so they're just all straight points. If you accidentally mess up, it's pretty forgiving. You can hit the delete key and it'll delete your last point. And you come back and click on the last point to start again and click, 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 click. If you delete the last one, which you can delete by clicking delete on your keyboard or by hitting backspace on your keyboard, if you do that, you do have to back up to the last one that you have available to it, give it a click, and then continue. So it's delete, click the last point, continue. Oh, I messed up. Delete, click the last point, continue. If you're finished, you can either go all the way back to the beginning and click and close the shape, or, if you'd prefer, I'm going to hit undo a couple times, if you're done while you're right here, you just go get the regular selection tool and click out in the middle of nowhere and you're done. So to review really quick, one of the things you can do with the pen tool is just click and set a straight anchor point. So everywhere you click, you're setting another point. If you mess up, you can hit backspace or delete, go back to the last point, give it a click, and then just continue. If you are done, you can close the shape, or you can just get the pointer and click someplace out in the middle of nowhere. Give it a shot. Make sure that you can click all over the place with the pen tool.